Hi, I'm on board of our most successful shadow boat toy carrier, our Yacht Support 5009. She's actually 55 meters long and loaded with ribs, wave runners, a little fun boat on top of the hangar. There's even a dive boat. There's even a decompression chamber on board of this boat. But we're all gonna see that when we walk on board. So this is the main deck of Blue Ocean. That's the name of our Yacht Support 5009. 225 square meter of deck space or approximately 2250 square feet. Really a large surface where you can store toys. We're supported by a big crane, 12 metric tons to lift the dive boat, to lift any heavy objects. So we're going up one deck. This is actually the, uh, the top of the garage. We put a nice little fun boat on top of it, but you can play some uh, snow bikes here, motorcycles, um, even hold a little electric car, you know, whatever, it's sturdy enough to hold quite some equipment. And then we have a little outdoor deck here for the crew maybe for some staff members. Um, can put a nice awning out here with some sunshades. Uh, great deck space to have. Well, let's have a look at the wheelhouse. Very modern Alvatron bridge. Um, don't forget, this boat comes from our commercial division at Daman. We delivered over 200 of these boats to the oil and gas industry. And it's for that reason that this very boat has DP, dynamic positioning. So if you're in deep water, if you are in an area where it's not really easy to drop an anchor because of environmental reasons, this boat will actually hold position without dropping an anchor. So from the wheelhouse, we're now going one deck lower, main deck, and we're entering a small little lounge, but it's a very cool place. It's a hangout for the crew members, for the staff, for the security staff. So when entering the accommodation area from the, the lounge on main deck, the first cabin on the starboard is your captain's uh, cabin. Very convenient, a desk, private bathroom. And of course, not your super yacht high-end finishes. Don't forget, this is a support boat, um, but very clean, well-built, very functional, um, call it elevated level of crew style that we've used in this boat. crew deck is connected to the engine room from this very nice silent environment. We're going to go to the engine room. It's a bit noisy because we have a generator running, but I want to show it to you because this is a unique space on board of Blue Ocean, on board of all our yacht support 5009s. We have a laundry facility and if you go to the other side, we have cold storage and freezer capacity massive fuel tanks and a very very spacious engine room look at the size and follow me off because this this is unique in yachting environment seven yellow caterpillars four of them main engines three of them generators and then if we go further off so from the relatively noisy engine room of course in a very quiet huge storage area. Call it your beach club or toy, toy storage area. Your F5s, your wave runners, this is what that storage is for. Another uh, storage locker over there. We have workbenches that we can install here and very essential or not unimportant to mention, 
a quite a substantial 5,000 liter uh, petrol storage uh, facility for the tenders. And then when I come up here, you can see that we're at the, uh, at the swim platform or the landing area for the, uh, the tenders. This is very often where people come on board and leave again. So the very high bow is part of that unique X-bow design that Dahman created. Um, this bow, the whole hull, is actually designed to deal with rough water situations. This is a high speed, or high speed, it's a 20 knot speed running boat. And it will actually run 18, 19 knots, which it reason, very recently did in five to six meter waves. And for that, we installed spray rails, rails that push the water outside so your boat is not getting too wet. Hope you like my little tour of Blue Ocean. Um, she could be yours. She's still for sale. She's here at the quayside today in Flissingen, and um, we welcome you to uh, to visit her.